really excited to uh, share this new amenity in Fairmount Park today. Uh, my name is Larry Hoopmer, um, principal planner, uh, landscape architect with the city of Wichita. Uh, I apologize, Mr. Troy Houtman, our director of Parks and Rec, is not here today, and I know he would have loved to been here. We've been talking about this improvement for quite some time, so. Uh, but anyway, it's just a pleasure to see everyone, everyone here today and our special guest, uh, Mr. Wooshock and Barry the Bison are here to, to do our celebratory first kick. So um, what a, it's just a great day to be here today. Um, and we're going to have some activities afterwards. Uh, with that, I'd like to go ahead and introduce our uh, council member for this district, Levanta Williams, uh, who has really worked hard behind the scenes and work with Wichita State and just does a great job for this district. Levanta? Uh, as Larry said, the weather was ordered. Uh, you couldn't ask for a better day in November to kick this off. Uh, most of you I know, but again, I am Vice Mayor Levanta Williams and I am so happy to be celebrating the rejuvenation of Fairmount Park. Uh, this is our historic Fairmount Neighborhood Park. Uh, Miss Faye Leach out there lets us use this every now and then, but she is a long-standing resident of Fairmount, and I am so uh, excited that our coalition, our Fairmount Coalition, is here as well today, led by Daryl Carrington and uh, Ted Ayers. So it takes a village to make things work right, and that's what we're working on today. We work to create a better sense of living well with amenities and to improve the quality of life for this neighborhood. It's a very um, involved neighborhood association and we're very excited to have this uh, go on in our park. The Fairmount neighborhood has faced many challenges as have many places around the city. In the past we've had some challenges and I hope that by rehabilitating this park we work to heal some of the difficulty that this park has faced and to rebuild it as a place for community and our neighbors to come together. The basketball court a little further to the east was completed in the fall of 2016 by Kansas Paving and we thank them for getting involved as well. Thank you to our partners at Builders Plus for building our beautiful new futsal courts. These are the first futsal courts in the Wichita Park System, so that means they're the first for the city of Wichita to have. Futsal courts are well represented in other countries and will help to serve a diverse student population at Wichita State University. So I'm hoping that this will be an attraction and a great usage, especially by our international students. And our international students live very close to these courts. So I hope that this is something they find very worthwhile as we begin to add some of the amenities that all of our students enjoy. These uh, courts include state-of-the-art, I said state-of-the-art, lighting with bleachers on either side for our spectators. We feel this will be a great beginning for potential future tournaments with teams from other cities. And I'm finding out that futsal is really growing across the state, that there are tournaments that go on. And I'm sure that our younger kids can use this as a soccer court as well. So I'm always looking for amenities that help our youth grow up and how we can make sure that they are involved so that we cut down on some of those activities that are undesirable. We feel this will be a great beginning for potential tournaments with other cities. And so I know that uh, Wichita State is very competitive. And if we go into futsal, we're putting our heart and soul into it. I'm so glad to be a part of a community that continues to grow, that continues to look for opportunities that fit for this particular community, and I think we found our niche right here. So I am so appreciative of our uh, Larry Hoopner, of Troy um, uh, Houtman, who is uh, Director of Park and Rec, and uh, they have come together with the coalition that we have, and we have said this is something that may work. So this is an exciting day for me. I want to thank everybody that is here. Angela Buckner, thank you for bringing in Barry and uh, Wu. And uh, hopefully we'll see them kind of play a little bit of futsal. But this is an exciting day for the Fairmount neighborhood area and Wichita State. So thank all of you for being here. Um, I'm not going to tell you I would have rather seen a lot of little kids, antsy kids ready to play. But that's what's going to happen. So I invite you to come by when the kids are on this court as well. So thank you all for coming out and uh, let's play ball.